morning, everyone, and happy Saturday, finally. Oh my gosh. I say that every weekend, don't I? You do. Oh well, that is what it is. We are out and about, and it's not even noon yet. Look at us. Look at us. I mean, like, that's amazing. Showered, we've had our Starbies, like, and we're out and about. Now, what are we doing today? Love that about you. Stay curious. We're going into the city to meet Jamie at the Wrigleyville Christmas Market. Now, if you guys don't already follow Jamie yet, go and check her out. Lux Petite. Her channel is fabulous. We're going to head into town, do the Christmas markets today. I don't know what else we're going to do, but it's going to be an adventure, so come along. What am I carrying today? Love that about you. Stay curious. So today, I was actually going to serve some vintage LV. I only really carry this bag when we're out traveling and not really when we're at home. So I'm going to carry it. You can see my little plastic target bag peeping out of the top of the pocket. That is to take our glue vine mugs home in. Mm -hmm. See, thinking ahead. We love that. Well, that was my idea. Well, don't get carried away. One good idea. <laughs> anyway, guys, let's go catch this train and head into the city. <laughs>
need to pick something up. <laughs> Make sure to check out her channel for the unboxing. It'll be up soon. <laughs> All right, guys. So, so far today, we hit up the Wrigleyville Christmas Market. And then Jamie, Zane, and I went over to Neiman Marcus. She picked up a little something from Celine. And now we're heading back down to the train station to head back out to the suburbs because we're worn out. <laughs> it was a fun day, but we're both tired. Yeah. Um, so far, I think we've just had Starbucks and Blue Vine. Oh, we had crepes. Crepes. Um, so I'm also starving. So we might hit the, um, the Daily Plaza Christmas market and then hit the train and head home. All right, guys, so scratch that idea. The uh, line for the Christmas market is wrapped all the way through the plaza and around the building. I don't want my rep that bad. So we're gonna head home. <laughs> <sighs> Sunday. We're feeling lazy today. We ran around the city all day yesterday and today we're just going to stay at home, hopefully get the Christmas decor up. been talking about it all week. <laughs> anyway, so now we're heading up just to pick up breakfast because I mean who wants to cook? And it's been a good morning so far. We did the premiere for the video and hopefully get to decorating. I'm so tired of talking about it. I just want it to be done. <laughs> so funny story. I totally forgot this but the other day was the 16th yeah 16th anniversary of Zane and I's first date to the movies we saw the holiday at Coldwater 14 which is no longer there no it's there I lied to you it was the other regal that's gone but anyway 16 years ago student rate 7 15 on a Saturday night we saw the holiday which has remained one of my favorite holiday films ever since I mean hello house and fashion goals through and through but I don't know that movie just has a special place in my heart all right, guys, so I hope that your Sunday fun day so far is going well, because so far, Zane and I haven't done a whole lot. You can tell I shaved. I look like a person again. You're welcome. Love that for me. Um, so far today, we went and picked up breakfast from our local local breakfast place. Didn't really feel like getting dressed up and going out, so I was just like, let's just go pick it up. It'll be fine. I had steak and eggs. We did the live premiere this morning for the newest episode. My whatever I bought for 2022, which low-key was like 29 bags, way too many. And I think I'm going to keep my Sunday premieres as live premieres. So that way we can chat as it's going on. I think that's a lot of fun um, to kind of like chat with you guys while it's going on and like just see what you think and like what, you know, it's fun to chat with you guys. I love it. So we're going to keep doing that on Sundays. Wednesdays and Fridays, I mean, I'm, I'm working when they go out, so I really don't have time to chat, but definitely on Sundays. We're going to keep that a Sunday thing. Zane's almost done. I'm going to play some video games while I wait on him, and then we're going to head to Target, and then we're going to we're gonna decorate, and you guys have a front row seat to all of it. Aren't you so lucky? Love that for you. Anyway, guys, let's go. Look at us out and about. So when I last checked in with you guys, it was almost three. Well, now it's almost four. We move slow. I'm worn out. <laughs> Zane is so tired, you guys. So <clears throat> we walked around the city all day yesterday, took the train, which isn't always a uh, big to do. And then he was up super late editing this morning's video. Uh, yeah, because we filmed it late. Well, there's that. Anyway, so we hit Starbies up. I got my caramel brulee latte, so I'm in much better mood. And today's bag, I love that you're so curious, guys. Stay curious. We are in the Duty and Burke North South crossbody, whatever it is. Oh. Who knows? Thank cold you. Outside. The BMW just told us it's 37 degrees Fahrenheit. So we are on our way to Target to get supplies, like nothing exciting this week, just a supply run. 
and then we have to go back and decorate. We have to get at least one tree up today. All right. We'll try. We'll try. It's Christmas is two weeks away and we are like bah humbug. We're just worn out. We've got a lot on our plates lately. Anyway guys, let's go to Target. <laughs> Happy Sunday evening, everyone. So we had our Starbies, we had our Target, we did a couple other errands, and <laughs> Merry Christmas. So we are now about to start start tackling the Christmas decor. I don't think either of us are really in the mood. We're just worn out. Worn out. Low-key, I have a lot more than I thought. Like, I keep looking, we have it all stacked up in the library from when we dumped it off last week. I'm not going to show you that because it is high-key embarrassing. But we have a lot of really cute stuff. Yeah. I just don't know how it's going to incorporate into this apartment. Our last apartment looked great in the holidays. This one, it's a little too modern to... We haven't done it yet in the holidays. Well, but you can I like our old layout better. Anyway, guys, let's decorate. So this is where we're at so far. Zane is enjoying some Olive Garden leftovers. <laughs> Poor little lemon tree had to go into storage. So we're gonna do a shroom tree here on the island. Over here is going to be my Wedgwood tree. Some more ornaments I forgot we picked up. I'm gonna figure out where those are gonna go. Back here, my little Target dollar spot cardboard houses. I made a little village. I thought that would look cute in the window. And we are watching New in Town. Renee Zellweger, 2009. We've watched it before and enjoyed it, but Zane doesn't remember. I don't remember. Lies. More gaslighting. The tree, couple of trees are up. We just need to start putting stuff on them. Yep. But I see progress, so I'm not feeling as bad anymore. All right, so tree number one is done. This is the whimsical shroom tree. I, it's probably one of my favorites, not gonna lie. <laughs> anyway, super freaking cute here on the island. I just hope it doesn't get in the way of YouTube videos. We can slide over. We'll be fine. Zane says we're fine. <clears throat> Next up, we need to do the Wedgwood tree. So Zane and I have been collecting Wedgwood ornaments for a very long time. And we've got a pretty decent collection built up. So I usually like to have one tree just dedicated to all Wedgwood ornaments with glass balls and the kind of the same colorway. So usually that'll go behind the sofa here. Let's get started on this tree and see where we're at. Tell the people what you did. Explain yourself, Zane Anderson. What did you do? I broke a bulb. The funny thing is, this is the same tree you broke a bulb on two years ago. Lies. It's true. <laughs> it's not. Did you have proof? No, nope, we weren't vlogging. Like this? We don't we were vlogging. Convenient. Convenient. Convenient lies. Why? Wow. Anyway, the Wedgwood tree though is coming along. <laughs> be a lot better if we didn't have to stop to clean up a bulb. Oh. <laughs> Tell the good people what just happened. Let me show them proof. It's not broken. It was close. Wow. You think that that's going to get you out of the doghouse for breaking <laughs> one of my very expensive hand-blown ornaments. We had these flown in from Switzerland. That's right. Target. Target. <laughs> So the Wedgwood tree is complete. So with this one, I, because it sits in the middle of the room, I usually do like a double 
bow back to back, just so that way, you know, like, no one wants to see the back of a bow in the middle of a room. And I just have the ribbon cascade down. With the Wedwood ornaments, we've, like I said, we've been collecting these for several years, so we have a lot of different ones. I need to get online and order one for this year. But, this is definitely one of my favorite trees each year to put out. All right guys, so that is a wrap on the week, the weekend, whatever it is. We're gonna share the footage of the extra trees that'll be added in. Anyway guys, thanks for joining us this weekend. It was a lot of fun. I'm super sad it's over, but it's 7.30. I'm gonna get a bite to eat, prepare for the work week ahead. Cause like I said, got some big stuff coming this week, which I don't really wanna speak to until it's done. Keep your fingers crossed for me though, folks. Catch me on Sunday, 10 a.m. Central Time. We'll do another live premiere. It was always a lot of fun to do. Anyway, I hope you all are having a fantastic week. Get ready for the weekend. It's almost Christmas time. I think Hanukkah also starts a couple days after this goes up. So that's exciting. Happy Hanukkah. Happy holidays. Merry Christmas. See you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.